looks like there's nobody in. Yeah, so... My disclaimer of... If you haven't seen the first episode and you're watching right now... Well... That's your warning. There's gonna be spoilers galore. And with that, let's hear some amazing theme music and I'm gonna get lost in this game for the next few hours. I know it. Previously on Game of Thrones. And then the music will start. Or it'll do nothing. These are dark days, I fear. Oh god, the hell has fell on him. He's the North Grove probably dead. Must never be lost. You're sending him to the war. The boy's done nothing wrong. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. I've decided to name you as my sentinel, Sir Wind. Oh, yeah. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Ah. My mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Rasha. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. You can be my highborn ward. Yep, that's where it got real. That's where it got real. Don't let them take me! Oh, and then they took the little dude. Alright, this is uh, Game of Thrones Episode 2, Lord of something something. Uh, Xbox One. Uh. Look out. Scares a scorpion on me. Asha. Asha's pretty cool. What's up, dragon? How are you? Whoa, it, it's just me, Beska. <sighs> Took you long enough. Your ale's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. Let's drink some. You can stop pacing. This There'll stuff be is soon. weak compared to northern ale. Down it. I want to drink. Spill. Oh. Is that wine? Or blood? Uh, taste it and find out. Uh. Fragrant. Nice having the place to ourselves, though. Looks like we weren't the first to rough up the place. Good. I'm pumped for this game. I'm so pumped to play this game. It's been a while since the first one came out, so. Look at her. I know, I know. Woman sell sword. Four years fighting by your side, and you still can't get over it. Come on, Asha. Quit staring. Let's get to drinking. Done. Deal. Ale. It goes in yellow, comes out yellow, waste time even drinking it, if you ask me. <laughs> Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing in Yunkai that doesn't. I know. It's a filthy haven for thieves, murderers, and other deadly bastards. You should feel right at home. I know I do. May we drink, thieve, and fight until the end. I'll drink to that. <laughs> You'll drink to anything. Yep. Another round?
Down the hatch. It's quite the scash. Have you forgotten about our honored and exalted guest? Go see if he's still breathing. Oh. Damn. Don't, don't do that. How's he doing? We need him alive to collect his bounty. After that. He looks fine. Fat and scared. Good. Let him stay that way. Until we collect our gold, at least. Damn. 800 gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. <laughs> they say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines, the best whores. Sleep in a bed without fleas? Sounds nice, doesn't it? We've not been paid yet, Beska. Can't spend dragons you don't have. We'll have them soon enough. My point is, with enough coin we could do anything. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking cares? It's all an excuse to tell everyone else what to do. They're still my family. My brothers and sisters. They had nothing to do with it. I suppose that's true. Just remember. We have a good thing here. And any moment now, we're gonna be rich. Stinking rich. Let's no? make a toast. All right. To we'll all of us that. deadly bastards. To us. Aye, to us. Oh. You're not that drunk, are you? Sorry. <laughs> that was weird. Beske, I thought freed slaves put the bounty on Bazak. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? That Tazal from the Volantis job. Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again. Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? I'd cut your fucking throats! That's not good. Tavern's closed. What are you doing here? Where is he? Where's who? Here. 400 dragons. They must be working for the wise masters. And that's all you're getting. The bounty is 800. You get four. It's more than you deserve. Give us 800 and you can have him. Don't be an asshole now. We're all sell swords here. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all Valyria. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Shit. Damn. Bloody hell. And we're done with you, too. Calm down, Tizal. We can still work out a deal. You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. The wise masters will hear how Asher Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. How he wouldn't take less than 800 gold dragons. So he killed Bezak instead. Me? Luckily, we were there to deliver swift justice. So you steal the money and we get the blame. Ponteos in us! Bojos me nomi shahoso kisikas! Uh oh. Am I gonna have to fight? Who dies first? Who wants to dance at the end of the oh. Kill them! Now! Nice! No one's more like. Here's one! 
Come on! That's... Oh, that is gonna hurt. She couldn't pass me! Did I just die? Fuck this goddamn game. <laughs> what? Uh... Welp. Alright, let's try that again. And why? Shit. Uh, pardon? Let go. Let go down. Uh, this guy. Uh, nice. You owe me one. Yeah. Throw it in his head. Throw it in his head. Oh, for fuck's sake. Give me like a millisecond to do it. This is why I should have bought it on PC. And why? Alright, there we go. Throw that through him. Oh. Miss her. And then down. And then. I guess I could have gone after the other guy this time. Matter. You owe me one. Go in his head! Shit, look out. Shit. That's a big sword. A button, A button, A button, A button! Y button! Oh, no, look out, look out. This is for Volantis. <laughs> Fuck you, Ash. Next. <laughs> I hit the fucking button. I hit it like four times. Telltale, get your shit together with these fucking cutscenes. Who fucking cares with these button mashing bullshit? You can do it. Grab it. Fuck you, Ash. Yeah, oh, way too fast. This is fucking stupid. <gasps> All right, get it. Fuck. So it goes blue, and then hit it. Can do it. This is fucking stupid. Okay, I'm gonna wait till it turns blue. Really? Ah, you just killed your own dude. It's fucking air. You know what this reminds me of? <laughs> that brothel in Norvos. Oh my god. What does that even mean? His hand just sitting there. You kill me, and the Lost Legion won't stop until you and your friend are dead. That fucking guy. Oh. 
fighting all the gods of fire and fuck. Who the fuck is he? My uncle. Tazal? Fuck. More on their way. We need to go. I uh, probably should have just killed that guy. Come on. Malcolm. Is there any gold Damn. there? We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop! Asher, I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. What are you doing here? Your brother Ethan sent me. I'm here to bring you home. Do it. Theme song. Do it. Yes! I played this game. This is this song. Look at it go. Heilenrach. Where else are we gonna go? Where else? I got chills. Hair standing up on edge. Fantastic. The Lost Lords. That's what it's called. Who are these lords and why are they lost? Seriously, I thought someone was whistling in my house, but it was only game. Wait a second. He's alive. That's cool. What is his name? It's Roderick or something. Look out. Say a damn thing, I'm thinking. I don't know. Thinking, don't say anything. Damn foresters. Have to be so fucking far away. Yeah, that's your, that's your buddy. You're dead. Something. That's far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. Lordly types from the looks of them. All right, we'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you paying for them? Sir Royland. You again. I, 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 you got this time? Some poor peasant dressed up like a I, lord. Uh, a stable boy I was, in Bannerman. Sir Royland. You did this at Duskendale. And you have the fucking stones to try it again. No! This house has suffered the loss of many good men. And you dare come here claiming to have Forrester dead. They're Forrester! Look at the colors! Fine trick. Leave. <laughs> now! Fine! I'll dump them in the river then! You come back here again, you won't be leaving. You got that? I, I heard you! That was a sheep fucker. <laughs> Oh. Don't worry yourself. Seven what is it, sir? This one's still alive. You Look there. at me. Who are you? 
It's me. Roderick. Roderick? Oh. Roderick! Oh, the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! Roderick! My lord. Yeah, you gotta drink that shit, man. That's it. <gasps> Roderick! My lady! No. I am at a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. How is he? Will he live? Let him. <gasps> Sir, my lady, I must insist that you leave. No. Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. As it is, you may never walk again. Roderick? What's wrong with him? He drank the milk of the poppy. Please don't leave me. Not yet. Mm -hmm. I'm going somewhere, sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Crazy. Hurt you. Are you all right? Come here, sister. Give her a hug. How bad is it? Did you take the leg off? Maestor Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. Oh, thanks, Debbie Downer. And your face. Tell them they don't look good. <laughs> I wouldn't dare. Yeah, I don't think I lost the limb yet. Who knows, though? Roderick, there's something you need to know. Uh -oh. Ethan is dead. Ethan? Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Like it was nothing. Ethan. How could this happen to him? We'll make Ramsay pay for what he did. I promise. Good. We're planning to honor Ethan okay, in the Ramsay. grove. Alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. A feel. <laughs> Then don't write it. And will understand. I wanted to write the song. I thought maybe he would write the song. It's been chaos here since he died. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. Small you folk. need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lord. You're still a hero to them. 
If you lead, others will follow. I know you still need time to heal, but... I'll be fine, Talia. The Council's meeting right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... I want to go. Hells yeah. Wheel them in. even stand? Nope. They could use your leadership. But if you're not ready... Only one way to find out. I missed you, brother. Now, Ben Adam. His face is fucked. You can do this, Roderick. I know you can. A button, A button, A button, A button. <laughs> Patrick! I'm fine. Why'd you do that? I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. I need to attend that meeting. And you will. But you will get there on your feet. It's a long way to the Great Hall. We can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. Thank you, Talia. Ready? Everyone will be so glad to see you up. Though, I think you'll find that much has changed. Black, so this is the seat of the Night's Watch. The wall. Always wanted to see it, but not like this. Recruit at the gate! for Frostfinger. On a horse, no less. Built by giants, doesn't it? You're new, here to take the black. Because mm. you got that look about you. I need to speak to the Lord Commander. We, uh, don't have one right now. It's Frostfinger you want. He'll get you sorted out. Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't let him scare you. <laughs> That's just his way. You seem nice, 
That's not so good round here. You fight like a girl. A wogling girl, maybe. Mr. Johnson. What's in these barrels? It's pitch. Dump it off the wall and it'll burn the wildlings down to their fucking bones. Your frost finger? You recruits. You come, you train, you fight, you die. Who are you, boy? I'm Gary Tuttle, nephew to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Gary Tuttle of Ironrath? And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the wall? You're a thief, a raper. You abandon your post, or do you just fancy dying someplace cold? I killed a man who murdered my family. Then you know how to fight, at least. And you're no liar, either. Sir? From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit, but then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. You are a killer. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. Yes, sir. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. Oh, and Tuttle, sooner or later, the Night's Watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. Last we'd heard, Asher was in Slaver's Bay, so Malcolm caught a ship headed for... They give us month-old bread! Ugh, there's fucking worms in it. The Lord Whitehill is about this. We should just take what we need. I'd rather die... The Whitehill soldiers always seem to be angry, and we have too few men to handle them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. You know what else? No fucking wine. Well, there must be wine in the cellars. De Gaulle's locked him up tight, just like his own cunt. He has no... Is that him? Has to be, doesn't it? He's hideous. <laughs> he's a had a run-in with Walder Frey, did And he's you? leaning on a girl. I should have buried him with the corpses. Forest is a real cursed. shame about your leg, my oh, lord. Gives a toss. Don't let go of your sister now. What? We have business in the Great Hall. <laughs> go round. Move aside, soldier. I'm quite comfortable, thank you. And I don't think you're gonna make me. I wonder what's weaker. Your legs? Or this house? Move! 
Now! Go on then, my lord. It's madness. You can't starve I them out. I will not coddle our enemies. So you'd rather they riot? Both of you, please. If they riot, we'll fight. That's foolishness. It doesn't matter what you think. It's my decision as Sentinel. My lords. Roderick. My boy. Come, join us. Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. It's good... <clears throat> it's good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. We didn't expect you so soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking, if you walked again at all. It was highly probable. I told you he'd be up and about. I'm not here to talk about my elf. Perhaps we should get started. Yes, let's. Dali has told me the state of our house. Then you know our situation is grim. No thanks to your sentinel. He's riling up the Whitehill soldiers. They're our bloody enemies! You'll bring Lord Whitehill down on us, you fool! My lords, please! Oh, I'm a fool! At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsay Sir Roland. stole... Ethan made it clear I wasn't wanted. He needed you there. Now he's dead and Ryan's a hostage. And what have you done to get him back? Nothing! Because we have no bloody army! It's because you have no wits! How dare you! I am your lord. Of course. Apologies, my lord. The Whitehills have my brother. We fight amongst ourselves, when we should be fighting them. We'd need an army to win that fight. And we don't have one. Not anymore. Summon our allies, then. I'm afraid we have none left, my lord. We've heard little from the Glovers since the Ironborn took Deepwood Mott. Houses Helleva, Grayson and Brownbarrow were all slaughtered at the Twins. And the rest of our allies are terrified of the Boltons. You forget the Glenmores. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as planned. The marriage? Well, much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Lady Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way here as we speak. Lady Elena? She's coming now! He's barely recovered. My betrothed is coming to Ironrath. Yes, my son. A raven arrived this morning. Lady Elena is eager to see you. If she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground! Yes, this marriage could be our chance. Of course, we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. Talking about a marriage, not an ironwood contract. I'm certain I can convince her. She's always been fond of you. Just be careful not to push Elena too hard. If Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting the stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute. Give them wine. I want them dull, not angry. Yes, my lord. Now, if there's nothing more to discuss. Maester, it's time to light the ironwood torches. Yes, my lady. Welcome back, my lord. 
It's good to be back. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. Ironwood doesn't burn easily, he told me. But foresters have a way. And now we light them for him and Ethan. How is your song coming? Ethan always helped me with music. It's not the same without him. I can help you with it. That's all right. The last time you sang, all the dogs in the kennel started howling. But thank you. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. Is that the letter to the orphanage? Yes, my lady. It's nearly done. Make sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. And mm, something nice after that. Lady Marjorie intends to visit again very soon. Lovely. They'll be pleased to hear that. I had to borrow that from father. Mine was stolen, can you imagine? I wonder who it was. Oh. Are there any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. Ah, yes. One of my father's favorite drinking companions. I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. What is it, Mira? It's from my mother. She asks that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. Of course. She knows you're very influential. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But it wouldn't be very discreet you'd be forcing their hand. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before and you saw the results. I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. I'd better get going. Mira, we'll talk more later. If Lady Marjorie wrote a letter... I'm sorry, Roderick. Sir Maynard, you are hereby invited... Mira, Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Sir Maynard? <sighs> The man's breath smells like a brew house. 
I was hoping I'd catch you at something slightly more exciting. A love letter, perhaps? Or a declaration of war? I know you're very busy with Lady Marjorie and... and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. If you don't mind. Go ahead, then. Well, it's... We really should get these letters sent first. Do you need any help with those? I've got them. be new here, but you're in my spot. So move. I'm not moving. Wrong fucking answer. Most of you will be dead within the year. <sighs> Frostfinger and his bloody speeches. If you want to survive in the Night's Watch, listen close. You know why I got sent to the Wall? The Wall was erected over 8,000 years ago. Why? Defend the realm from wild At this girl I used to fuck now and again. And Face like a queen, tits like a whore. Turned out she was married to some lordling. He tried to stick me with this. I stuck it in him instead. So next time I say move, you'd best fucking move. Shut up east, for once, will you? What's your problem? I'm sick of Finn bragging about all the girls he's fucked. And what dire crime are you here for? Fucking potatoes. Potatoes? You fuck potatoes? What? No! I stole them. That's what got me sent to the wall. Nobody cares, thief. Don't call me that. Big my name's Cutter. Cutter the potato fucker. There's one for the songs. Oi, my sister was hungry. I've got something for your sister. Hey, don't fucking talk about my sister, all right? Well, I got sent here for... Who in seven hells is talking back there? Tuttle. What's up, David? Who was it? It's me. Sorry, sir. It was my fault. Covering for your new brothers already, are you? Garrett Tuttle here wants to be a ranger. So we can go north of the wall and die on some wildling spear. But what he wants doesn't mean shit. So today you're all gonna show me what you're made of. Can you swing a sword? Shoot a bow? Are you strong? Those who do well might just survive. The rest of you. Frostfinger. <laughs> I need a word. Oh, you fucking John Snow! Go on, get started. You fuck potatoes. <laughs> I had to say it. It was like... It just had to Best happen. Best of luck, Tuttle. I want to make that guy my friend. He's massive. He's got that... Sharpie. Uh, either help that guy or here we go. Oh, Again. Who's up? See those dummies? Those are fens. Come to eat your brains for breakfast. You've had a sofa. Demonstrate your combat skills. I also want I wanna help that dude out. You there, recruit. Scrawny, aren't you? See if you can carry one of these barrels over to the winch. Right. I can do this. Uh, can you? Oh, and down. Up. And up. 
Thinking steward for you. You can help Frostfinger wash his cock. If the thing hasn't frozen off. Oh, you're a prick. You know that. Yeah, I do. John Snow. You know nothing, John Snow. Uh oh. Is there choices or I just grab this that one? one should do. Practice sword. I'll be Looks a lot like a real today. sword. I want to spar with that Remember, dude. These blades are dulled, but a sword's still a sword. Oh. Good luck. Uh. <gasps> Oh shit. Wake up! Controls are stupid. Can't move. Nice. Ooh, look out. Well full. What's up, Arkies? Get off me, you bloody ox. Bloody ox. You got lucky. I fight that guy. Yeah, let's fight him. I want to fight him. What the fuck? Just dummies. You're doing that all wrong. But we don't have these. We're like. Oh. oh Man's Raider will shit himself when he sees you coming. <laughs> Let me show you. It's so easy, is it? What did I do? Bloody recruits. Alright, let's see if you can aim worth a wildling's arse. Shoot the targets, I tell. Let's start easy. Middle dummy, center of the chest. Boom! You can follow orders at least. Next bolt. Left target. Head. Head. Oh, voila. Good. Right target. Chest. We did this. Good aimer. Not bad. Not bad. Center. Between the eyes. Oh shit. Oh shit. It's off. One less wildling. Nice. Good at you this. Hit all of them. Nicely done. Fuck yeah. Let's shoot the other guy in the face. Oh, that's a scowl. I'm not sure if he's improving or disapproving. That guy shot himself in the toe. Finn thinks he's so bloody clever. If a real wildling got his hands on him, he's just a bully. Aye, he is. That's why I took this. Oh! Swiped it right off him. I like it. Don't tell, alright? I don't think he'd take it kindly. Give it back to him, Cotter. Are you mad? That's the last thing I'll do. 
Finds out that you have it. You're dead. You're pathetic. Fuck off. You didn't even try. A crossbow's a coward's weapon. Besides, I could hit that dummy from here with my... Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? If someone has it, I'll cut their fucking balls off. Maybe someone stole it. Who the fuck would have... It was you. What? You little fucking thief. It weren't me. Finn, don't. <gasps> Give me my knife. I don't have it, I swear. Out of my way. Got it. Do something. Stop it. Before some... <gasps> oh, shit. I won't say it again. Step the fuck aside. If you ever hit me again, I swear I'll... <gasps> yeah, that's right, you slow motherfucker. Oops. Hey, look. Fight! Fight! Yeah, get it! Here they go again. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Take it. Take it. Oh. Get off. What is going on here? He stole my fucking knife. No, I didn't. And Garrett defended him. The last thief I caught no longer has hands. I swear I don't have it. He must have hid it. <laughs> and you. I expected better, Tuttle. Instead, I find you doing this on your first bloody day of training. Sir, I... Not another word. You clearly need a few days scrubbing the latrines. Frostfinger, I need another man atop the wall. Fine. Let him freeze his balls off. I'll deal with this one. Get off! <laughs> My Damn. fucking manners. You, come with me. This way. I love King's Land.